I have been asked on multiple occasions regarding my political commentary and public satire about the political environment here in the United States, why is it that I seem to fixate on the left, I mean the right, sorry, that was a Freudian slip, why is it that I seem to fixate on the right? I've even been accused of blatantly ignoring the problematic issues on the left. And so I feel compelled to share this thought as I've been kind of pondering it all afternoon. Um, I see the problematic issues on the left. I see the problematic issues on both sides. But let me answer that question with a set of questions of my own. Which side is it that pretends to have the only absolute truth? Which political party in the United States claims to be fighting for the little guy in the name of Jesus Christ himself? Which party acts as if it alone has all the answers which party truly hypervilifies everyone else that does not agree with them? I don't know about you, but from my perspective, impartially observing the right versus left and left versus right ideological double barrel echo chamber of American politics, can only answer those questions by saying, well, that's the right for you. And that's what I'm focused on. You see, I was raised within the context of organized religious indoctrination. And uh, maybe at a bizarre, for some people, maybe an, in an inordinately young age, I started asking questions. Because one of the things that never really made sense to me was how any organized religion could claim to know the absolute truth and maintain that every other group is full of lies. None of that make none of those kinds of claims make any sense to me. Do I blindly hate the right? Of course not. They are fellow human beings. Human beings over identified in a personal identity kind of way with a political party. Human beings caught up in a political form of indoctrination, human beings clinging to ideology in the face of problems that require us to transcend the ideology that we cling to. Now, does some of this apply to the left as well? Yeah, I mean, undoubtedly. Some people get as personally wrapped up in the politics of the left and the identities that those parties and politicians seem to be able to provide for people as anyone on the right. But in the last 30 years of observation, it has been the right, the political GOP, the self-proclaimed warriors for Christ that have been most egregious in their hypocritical actions taken in the name of their divine God. I don't know about you, dear listener, but... After a lifetime of questioning and seeking and observing and experimenting and using my critical faculties, I've come to a conclusion that's very unpopular in the United States, and that's this. I personally cannot agree with any ideological constructs that requires a organized religious-style blind faith belief. Why? Because I cannot detect any real evidence that whatever is actually out there, whatever real divinity exists, has any interest in politics whatsoever. Only the ideological cartoon character made up persona that is the man-made God has interests in politics. Usually because that cartoon character is being created and perpetuated by a political party. And now, back to your regularly scheduled daily Zencast.